Hi everyone, welcome to C programming tutorial series. In my last video, I did the discussion on a very important topic which is execution process of C program. And in today's video, I am going to discuss about C tokens. So before coming to today's topic, I just want to tell you guys that if you guys like this video, click on like button, share it with your friends, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and if you guys have any queries then let me know in the comment section. Now let us start our discussion on the very simple topic of C tokens. So C tokens are called as the basic building block of C programming or it is also called as the basic component or the smallest unit of C program. So if we want to write any C program then we must know the tokens concept. So what is this token? So in our day to day life whenever we have a communication with other people we try to have a communication with various languages we make use of various languages and while speaking with other people we make use of words characters statements grammars and without the help of these words and grammars and characters we cannot have a communication with others Exactly the same way, if I want to write any program, then I must require two keywords, identifiers, words, letters, symbols, operators. Okay, so each and every of these are called as tokens. Whenever you will be sitting to write any program, so each and every character, each and every word, symbol, special character, alphabets, each and every of those things are called as tokens okay that's why token is been considered as the basic building block of c program without the help of token you cannot write the program in a passage of text individual words and punctuation marks are called tokens okay so whenever you write any program each and every words punctuation marks characters symbols operators each and every of those are known as tokens Next point is C has six types of tokens which we will see in our next slide. A compiler breaks a C program into tokens and then proceeds ahead to the next stages used in the compilation process. Okay. So whenever compiler start compiling each and every instruction or a statement of C program first breaks the entire statements into tokens and then proceed ahead uh, to perform various stages or activities of compilation process. Now let us move ahead to the next slide to see an example for token. Okay, So here I have written down a very simple example. So here you can see whatever words or statements, functions and keywords I have used in this program all are termed as tokens. Okay, So this num is a token this val is a token okay and this can also be considered as a token so each and every word each and every sentence special characters used in this program are termed as token okay so now next is here i have written the classification of token so as i have told you that tokens are classified into six categories first one is keywords then second one is identifiers then constants strings special symbols and then operators okay so one by one we will going to see these concepts in our upcoming videos okay so this is everything about uh, token i hope you guys have understood what is token so that's all for this video guys i will see you guys in my next video on some other topic so if you guys like this video click on like button share it with your friends don't forget to subscribe to this channel and if you guys have any queries then let me know in the comment section and thanks for watching